I hear you two had quite an adventure in Sobrik. I'm impressed by your commitment to saving lives. Convincing an Imperial to surrender on his home turf. That's one for the Archives. You make a pretty great team. We should do this more often. I couldn't do this mission without you, Doc. It's big of you to admit that. A lot of guys are intimidated by my talents. This is Nicolan Cord, one of the top resistance leaders. He analyzed the data we obtained from Sobrik, found us a lead. One of our spies was captured weeks ago, attempting to steal what might be the Empire's cloaking device project. The data revealed where she's being held. Sounds like someone we should talk to. How do we free her? We believe she's inside an Imperial Tactical Operations base. Heavily fortified, protected by a regiment of troops. That's where I come in. Colonel Finley commands the Republic's 5th Expeditionary Force. He's agreed to assist our operation. Trouble is, if that Tech Ops space crew sees my troops marching in, they'll close the blast shields. Those shut, there's no getting them open. My weapon can cut through anything, even a blast shield. No time. If the enemy summons reinforcements while we're stuck outside, we'd be trapped. One of you Jedi could slip inside, disable the blast shields before they close, then the base would be ours. We'd have to distract that Imperial Regiment, create an opening. My troops provide quite a distraction. The Resistance must be part of this. Our spy won't talk if I'm not there. I'll escort the Resistance. That leaves you to penetrate the base and deactivate those blast shields ahead of our arrival. Get your forces ready, Colonel. We leave immediately. I can guarantee an enthusiastic response. I'll prepare my forces to move out. That resistance leader. Let's keep an eye on him. His spy is the key to our victory, and he knows it. Get inside the Empire's base and deactivate those blast shields. We'll be waiting for your signal. <laughs>